hey guys what's going on uh, welcome to your seventh HTML and CSS tutorial now in this tutorial we'll be discussing about tags and attributes in HTML in last tutorial I used a couple of tags <laughs> uh, a couple of uh, attributes which are care set and lang now I would like to officially explain what attributes are in HTML now just like we write tags now attributes are kind of linked to your tag and supply additional information to the browser that <coughs> what this tag does so for example HTML is completely fine here but when we are using lang as a tag as an attribute then we are supplying some additional information about this HTML tag or basically this HTML document that its language is EN which stands for English now here we are using the tag as meta now this meta tag is completely valid but when we use meta char set that means that, that we are using a character set of UTF-8 now attributes are really important in HTML because they play a very important role of assigning and basically kind of using attributes in various ways uh, using tags in various ways to be more precise and let's la take a look at some of the tags which use attributes as a very kind of mandatory way in a very mandatory way so let's say if you want to create a link to uh, when the user clicks on a bunch of text to redirect user from your page to some other site so how would you do that well we make use of a tag which stands for anchor tag and let's see how it does so let's type a and give it a space so that your tag uh, your attributes get separated by your tag because if you don't give a space then this would be considered as one single tag so space separates tag from its from its attribute now to assign a value to an attribute press equals to and inside quotes write the link you want to link to for example a tag which stands for anchor tags is used to link two documents among themselves and href basically refers to the link or uh, the reference where we want to send the user to for example whenever user clicks on this tag he would be redirected to this link so let's close this tag and write some text like Google now let's close this a tag now whenever the user clicks on Google the user would be redirected to this URL which is inside href now these are special attributes uh, which are already being parsed by the DOM API um, I'll discuss that later so don't worry about DOM so basically this is these are special tags which are parsed by the browser and uh, the, your browser already knows that when the text is enclosed in a tag then look for href and on click redirect user to this URL inside the href attribute so now let's reload this and we have got Google now if you hover over this then you can see down here that the URL is google.com which uh, kind of appears that what would happen we would be redirected when we click this so once I click this I would be redirected to google.com or in my case google.co.in for Indian version so that's how tags and attributes work all together to create a fancy and nice looking HTML page and in the future tutorials we would be using these attributes a lot a lot so just memorize what are attributes and tags in HTML because we're gonna need them a lot so hope you like the tutorial and don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching